Hi, this is Chris, and today I'm going to show you how to book VAT transactions or value added tax transactions into universal accounting. You can see at the top left corner of the screen that we are using the advanced version of universal accounting. Let's open the booking entry page by clicking on the icon or on Ctrl E. The first field at the top of the page is the date. It will show today's date by default. Click on the drop-down arrow to select another date if needed. Move to the next field by clicking on the tab key or if enabled in your settings on Enter. Let's book a sales transaction. We'll debit the bank account and credit a revenue account. In this example, product yield abroad. Just above the account name, you see a field. This is where we enter the amount to be posted in each account. The document number is displayed automatically if you have set up a rule for that in your settings. Otherwise, you can enter it manually. In the field called Amount USD, enter the value that is subject to the VAT. In this example, we enter 10,000, which is the full amount of the transaction. In the case of a sale to a foreign country, as is the case here, the VAT code is not populated. You can still add one manually by clicking on the drop-down arrow. Let's select code S12, which means a 12% VAT rate. The corresponding VAT amount is then displayed automatically in the next field. Type the description of your sale in the text field. Here we enter fabrics. If you would like to save your entry and work on it again later, Click Save or Enter. Your entry will be saved in a batch. When your entry is final, click on Book Batch to post it into the transactions, account sheets and vacant positions. You do have the option to set up the system to post directly without using a batch. Now we see the entry in the transaction list with the net value and the value added tax. At this stage, you can still delete the entry if you need to. Click on Account Sheets and enter the document number. You now see the journal entry, which is the detail of the amount booked into each account. Very important about the VAT codes. When we book an entry, we want the VAT code to appear automatically on the screen when we select the Product Yield Abroad account. Here is an example to change the S12 rate of 12% to 5%. So go to the chart of account, select the account from the list, do a right mouse click to open the pop-up menu and select edit account. We enter S5 and press OK to save. Going back to the booking, Enter the Product Yield Abroad account as the credit account and the VAT field is automatically populated with a new VAT rate. If you want to book entries net of VAT, go back to the VAT table, select the rate that you want to adjust, here for example P6, and check the net box. Then go to the transaction list and you can see the entry showing the net amount. To book a sales discount, go to the debtors for a list of open balances. Select the line item that will receive the discount. Open the booking entry form and enter the discount amount. For the VAT code, we have to pick an SD code, here SD6 for a 6% VAT rate. Go back to the debtors vacant positions, you see that the open balance has been reduced by the amount of the discount. In the account sheets, you see the journal entry for the sales discount. Remember that you can edit the VAT table as needed. This is it for the VAT transactions. Thank you for choosing IT Express.